not everyone in America is considered a technologist and not every one of us understands all the interworkings of our telephones and yet we use them every day. There are other foreign countries that bring their people to America and they abuse our rights in every way. Children of foreign East Asian countries that are actually the producers and manufacturers of our telephones are probably much better at understanding the internal workings of our telephone. But at the same time, we have manufacturers of telephone that are making in external and internal agreements with strategic alliances that are requiring them to put all sorts of games and other software on our phone, which most of us don't want or need. The hard part we also run into is that we're somehow not allowed to own our phone. Meaning, I'd like to remove a bunch of this crap on my phone that I don't feel is right for me to have taking up memory and taking up space and time and taking up operations and taking up systems, and I'd like to remove it, but the problem is sometimes we're not sure if that software piece is required for the functioning of our phone. Now, when I'm saying this, what I'm really talking about are technologists that are doing clipping. That was really the forced title that I was supposed to be talking about, is clipping. There are technologists that like to do clipping, and usually they are abusers of technology and abusers of information that you don't have at your fingertips. A clipper will simply, simply say, I'm going to clip this image because I feel like it. I'm going to clip this video because I feel like it. And they're not actually listening to the content, or not actually caring about the picture of what they're clipping. 